I'd like to welcome everybody here to the Mountain View Community Center uh, for the ribbon cutting ceremony to open New Mexico's first Nature's Explore Outdoor Classroom. It's pretty awesome, right? Yeah. First one. So uh, Bernalillo County and the Valle del Oro National Wildlife Refuge have teamed up to create this great outdoor space in the middle of the Mountain View community. When the county was approached about this project, we knew it was going to be something great for our community. So we wanted to get behind it for sure. So the land here at Mountain View Community Center was made available as well as many hours of planning, design and building by county staff. Not everybody gets a chance to go to our refuge. So we thought we would bring a piece of the refuge here to the middle of our Mountain View community. And we started working on this project quite a while ago. Bunny and I started talking um, pretty soon after I became manager there and she became manager here and I knew right away that because of the amazing relationship Bunny and the Mountain View Community Center staff has with our community that this was the perfect place to build a mini refuge classroom. This was not an easy task. We have planned it for four years and it cost a lot of money. I think U.S. Fish and Wildlife gave us over $60,000 for this project and it really was exceptional. But not only did we have government support from the county and all of our land management people, we had support from this community and that was criti critical. We have a couple of representatives today. Payam Gorsham with PG Enterprises here. We have Jamin Hutchin and she's with New Mexico Transloading and Brandy Ganser. Um, we have people from Boise Cascade. Kenny Brick was really involved and they gave us a lot of the pavers. Ace Leadership. They are a high school from this community and they came out and they built all of the signage. Bernalillo County Land Management put it all up. We also had the Friends of the Isle that all the people here who helped us organize our community planning day and they were very involved. Dimensions Education. They are a nationally recognized group of people who brought us together and gave us a path on creating this Nature Explore Outdoor Classroom. But finally, I gotta thank the staff here at Mountain View Community Center. They have been phenomenal. Barbara, Mario, Mario is having surgery so he couldn't be here. Pauline, Patty, James is our volunteer. All of our staff that are here day to day, they make such a difference. Okay, so if you're wondering what a Nature Explore Outdoor Classroom is, it is a space that offers interactive elements such as musical instruments made of natural materials, a garden, pathways, and uh, natural materials for building and creating art. So I'm honored to be here today because art is my life. I know that they introduced you guys to me as your county commissioner because that's what I am, but what I do for a living is I'm an artist. Um, I'm an actor and um, I'm a comic, and I'm a, I draw, and I paint, and I played music when I was young, and I danced, and so if it wasn't for art and music, I probably wouldn't have a pathway for me. And so things like this are extremely important to me because art is everything, and art is everywhere. And you get to experience that along with nature. And, and plants and growing and, and, and we know now in the community that growing food is very beneficial, it's very therapeutic and so we're glad that we're able to provide that kind of service to you guys here in the Mountain View area and in the South Valley where we seem to always be the last to get something and so today we are the first to get something. So the garden has received national certification from the Arbor Day Foundation and Dimensions Educational Research Foundation. The certification confers upon Mountain View Community Center a number of benefits, including membership to an, to an ever-expanding network of more than 380 spaces nationwide. We started in 2014 with just a couple garden boxes here. Does anybody remember doing some gardening? Some of you older students remember doing the gardening out here and we just had a couple little boxes and we must have been doing something right because we got lots of money from U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service at our headquarters to help build this for our community 
And now after a couple years of community input and lots of support, we have an amazing project where you guys can play outside, learn about the outdoors, see how art and nature come together and hopefully be inspired to come visit your refuge down the street. Okay. Three, two, one. Yay! Yay!